Uh, today, we would like to introduce about the packing belt for the brick factory. Uh, basically, there are several specifications we have to check. Number one is the thickness of the packing belt. Basically, now we have 0 0.85, 0 0.8 millimeter, and 1 millimeter for the brick factory. Uh, most of the time, we are using these three for our brick packing. Uh, here's one thing if you need uh, uh, more bricks in one stack, you need to make it more thicker. But if it is thicker, uh, since this conveyor belt are selling by the weight, you will use it for less time, which means that you have uh, less, uh, you have you spend more for, for the same weight. So it really depends on the situation you are used. Most of the time, 0 0.85 is good enough for uh, most of the cases. And the second thing is about the width. Uh, the width, the width for the packing belt, we have 15 and 16. Most of the time, we are using for 15 millimeter. Uh, this is uh, proved that uh, good for packing the bricks. And number three is about the strips. We have the we have the smooth one, and we have the strips one. You have the strips one. Uh, the strips one actually can provide extra function, extra fraction in between the packing machine uh, and the belt. Most of the time, most of the time you can just uh, use the smooth one, uh, since most of the famous brand of packing machine come from Germany or Italian, like a Titan or SEW, like those brands. You can use the smooth one. But if you buy the uh, packing machine from some not that famous brand, uh, the strength, the strength is provided to you to make the package tight, which is not that enough, then you need to buy the strips one. This can provide you extra fraction in between the belt and the packing machine. And basically now for this, this width and this strength, our Smooth one and our surface one can provide 600 kg and 580 kg. When you strip it, a little bit loss for the for the strength of the packing belt. And regarding the lens, actually the lens is highly highly related to the weight. Now, if we take this two for example, for 1,300 meters, the weight is 20 kg. For 2,000, it's 38 kg. Uh, our clients tell us they want to make it bigger. If you make it bigger, of course, you will change it not that frequently. But basically, judging for, from our experience, for 1,300 meters, you can use it for at least four hours, five hours. For one morning, you change one row, it's not a heavy work. But for the 2,000 meters, some of our clients, they they complain that the row you made is too heavy and need to squat and try to carry this to my machine from my warehouse, which is too heavy. And as a law from the labor, we don't allow our worker to do this carrying for 38 kg. You need some machine to move this. So we don't think it's that convenient. Most of the time we make 20 kg for our clients. But if you say, in within this, I, I do not want that heavy and I don't want that short. We can make 1,500 kilometers and 25 kg for you. Thank you, everybody. This is Frank. Thanks for watching our video. Bye bye.